what is going on my bueno people uh, I'm gonna bring this more over here take that turn that up so I can sort of hear myself what is going on my bueno people uh, this is gonna be a different type of video I have to head to a meeting in a uh, couple of hours some great news I gotta be quiet though uh, people are trying to sleep in the house um, so basically uh, let me adjust my head real quick that way y'all can see my pretty face because for some reason it does not want to focus you gonna focus or you're not gonna focus you can see the D&D table over here there will be a D&D video later on uh, probably next week um, we had a four-hour session last night and there's a lot of things I need to cut out <laughs> that were said uh, so you guys are gonna get an abridged version of the session but it is what it is it's also a mess over here but don't don't fret about that <sighs> so anyways um, if you've been watching the streams the two that I've had I've mentioned this thing called the runaway um, I have a song called The Runaway, which is on the channel. You can check that out. Um, but there is a musical called The Runaway, which is about Finn, um, the character Finn from The Force Awakens. Let's just say from Star Wars, because he's in he's in three of the films. Uh, anyways, it's his perspective during The Force Awakens, and more of a retelling of the character um, to kind of give him a better setup and a better chance. Um, and what we plan on doing with this is we're gonna see how this first one takes. Then we're going to work on a script for a rewrite of The Last Jedi. And then we're going to do a Rise of Skywalker uh, take as well. And it's not even going to be... The more we get into it, uh, the more it's going to be more of an original take. And yeah, stuff like that, which I'm very, very excited for. Um, so it won't be like you're going to a musical version of The Rise of Skywalker. What you're doing, you're going to a musical version of... A story within that story but we get more further in depth into that main character so it's gonna be inspired by the films but not a word for word scene for scene shot for shot thing it's definitely going to be its own story and um, I hope the runaway itself sort of follows you know has its own its own thing set up what I what I want to do real quick is play you some of the music if you've been watching the streams I'm sure you have um, seen that or heard that, uh, heard some of the songs. Um, the song is called Obey the Call. Let's go, let's go, hey, let's go, let's go, hey. Keep a level head, don't overthink your words, stand up straight and be a part of the herd. So yeah, like it's always do your best. This show Hold on. So what is bothering me? They say that we're the first line of defense to protect the galaxy. So why am I feeling so much doubt to the words they say to me? You gotta keep breathing, you gotta keep leaping. Over every hurdle Gotta keep your cool in the face of it all And most importantly, obey every call Let's go, let's go, hey, let's go, let's go So anyway, so the show is very much, um, we're taking it from the beginning So not Finn's origin necessarily, but more you see him in training and when the, it started to mess with him and what exactly it was that messed with him. So you've got, it could be the Force, it could be his programming, it could be, it could be whatever. In this story I'll tell you right now, it's the Force that kind of talks to him. And he even says that in The Rise of Skywalker that the Force is what kind of led him to the path that he ended up taking. Let me get that out there, I always look at it. So that's really... <sighs> really canon wise it's been confirmed the force is what kind of sort of drove him to uh become you know kind of run to the resistance even though he wanted to run originally um i don't know why i grabbed the saber but hey just there uh but yeah so 
that's what the show's about. It starts from the beginning of him as a stormtrooper, and then we go into him meeting Poe, and then we, we also have Ray's story in there still. Ray's still very important to the story. She always will be. She's always important to Finn. She'll definitely be in there. Kylo's in it. Hux is in it. Phasma's in it. We get to know the stormtroopers a little bit more. So the stormtrooper that he fights, Atakadana, uh, the one who says, Traitor! Uh, we actually get to know him, we get to know his names, and we get to actually see that relationship and, and why it was such a big deal that Finn uh, ran. I mean, it's a big deal anyways, but what was so important for that Stormtrooper to where it became a deathmatch? And we get to learn that. Uh, we get to learn about the Stormtrooper at the beginning of the movie who ends up dying and does the, you know, who, who causes this to happen. You know, the... So we, we, we get to we get to learn a little bit of that stormtrooper. We we get to meet. We actually get to see what happens to Poe um, when he's on Jakku. Very exciting. We get to meet a new character named uh, Jn um, that is not uh, that is not in the movie. He is in the book, but it's not his name. So this character is actually an original character. So it's it's almost like taking the character who saves him on Jakku and um taking snap wexley and combining them into one character and that's what this character is so that's what i'm saying like it, it's not we're taking force awakens and putting it on stage what we're doing we're taking finn's story and we're adding in our own beats and we're trying to make it its own story so you can watch the movie and then watch this and kind of be like i see what they're going for that's probably the route they should have gone um, and so I'm very excited for it. We start rehearsals on Thursday. Uh, I'm going to a meeting soon, a couple hours, like I said, to discuss location of the actual performance. Um, so I'm very excited about that. Uh, the cast album, when it is done, will be for free, free download. Um, donations will be greatly accepted. And I'm very tempted to start a Kickstarter for this as well to kind of help us with some things. But other than that, if you guys want to listen to the soundtrack, it is on SoundCloud. Um, I will put a link in the description to that. Uh, if you want to hear, not the soundtrack, but the demos, um, I would definitely recommend waiting until the cast album is done. Uh, that should be done sometime around April, hopefully. Um, and yeah, I'm super excited to get the runaway started. Um, FN2187 is my favorite Stormtrooper and my favorite character, so... Uh, it's, a, it's, it's an honor to to be able to actually get this done and do it. So just want to let you guys know what was going on. I don't have a whole lot of time today, but um, just keep up keeping you guys. And, and again, thank you for those of you who showed up from uh, Captain Irish's channel. Steven, thank you so much for sending them over. Hope you guys enjoyed the content. I do plan on streaming at some point today. Look at that. Look, look at that beauty. Look, look. Like thumbnail so anyways guys um thank you so much for watching and uh i will be back and uh that looks so beautiful like i'm sorry like the, the lighting today just looks so good anyways i'll see you guys later Bye.